As part of tunneling QA and deliverables, TVC includes several types of pre-constructed reports in the Tunnel ASCII Reports command. These are tunneling reports that were previously available in the standalone ASCII file generator that previous Trimble Access Tunnel customers may have used. These are now available built within TBC. These reports offer limited customization but can provide quick deliverables in a multitude of formats for many purposes. Before we generate any of these Tunnel ASCII reports, we need to ensure that we have our tunnel design represented here by the tunnel mesh, our as-built points as seen here, and we need to ensure that these as-built points are assigned to a station. We can open up the assign tunnel points command and we can see that we in fact already have our points assigned to the station. So from here we can access the tunnel ASCII reports command from the ribbon or we have a quick link here from assign tunnel points. In our report UI we have some familiar fields. We have the tunnel we want to generate a report from, the surface we want to use, and then here we have the stations and the points that are assigned to that surface within the tunnel. We have our begin and end station, which defaults to the entirety of the horizontal alignment. We can choose to create a subsection of this to run the report if we want. We have a field to determine the save location of our file, and if we want to view it on output. Down below we have some settings and options that may or may not be applicable for the chosen report. We can see here at the top of the command we have our report types. These also match up with the report types in the drop down in the ribbon. We'll briefly go over all these types and what sort of information they provide. The first two types we have are Amberg and Beaver. These are files that are generated specifically for these types of tunnel software. We can see the Amberg report consists of a date and timestamp, as well as a station, a horizontal offset, and a vertical offset from the tunnel alignment. We have the Beaver report which consists of an index number, northing, easting, and elevation values. With the exception of the two MS Word reports and the areas and volume report, the main reports a variety of HTML and CSV formats that describe the as-built points in relation to the tunnel design and specified tolerances. Cross-section points consists of the point ID as well as the cord, which is the distance from the station alignment, the station and the delta value for underbreak or overbreak. The profile detail report is an HTML report. It gives you every point name as well as the specific underbreak or overbreak at that point along with the station delta, i.e. how far away that point is from the specified station. The next two reports we have are Microsoft Word reports, the Profile MS Word report and the Profile MS Word report with areas. These are both very similar, with the exception of the latter reporting underbreak and overbreak areas of the report. We want to ensure we're opening it as an XML document in order to read it. And we can see here we have an image of our geometry and our as-built points. This is very similar to the custom report. We also have a table detailing some point and its information, as well as with the area report, we have this area table. One important thing to note with the profile MS Word report, along with being able to specify the station tolerances so we can flag what's out of tolerance, we also have some options here that will change how the image in our report is shown. Next we have the profile report. This is another HTML report. It will give you a summary of the number of tunnel as-built points you have at each station, how many are out of tolerance, if they're out of tolerance for overbreak, underbreak, or station tolerance. We have the profile areas and volume report. This will show you the design area as well as the undercut or overcut area at each station, as well as a total design volume and undercut and overcut volume and the total excavated volume. This is based on the average end method based on the areas at each station. Finally, we have the underbreak report, which is a simple point ID northing easting elevation station that just shows the as-built underbreak points. 
That concludes a brief demonstration of the report types available in the Tunnel ASCII report command. These reports can be saved for you or your client's future reference, or they can be printed off to be shared.